G'day guys, I've, um, I've returned back to this creek I was at on one of my other videos um, and I've, I was getting quite a bit of black sand here so I've come back and I'm going to do some more test panning and collect, a, um, collect up a heap of black sand I'm going to take it home and run it over the metal table and um, yeah, give it one last shot and see if there is any gold here in this creek so plenty of potential here, a lot of gravels, a lot of big rocks um, I'm going to try and dig down to the bedrock this time because that's where all the goodies are going to be yeah, anyway I'll get into it and I'll get back to you I've been digging all over the place, dug in there at the base of this tree that's where I got a bit of black sand last time I was here so then I dug over here no good dug here and now I've moved up the creek a bit further and I'll, I'll show you the black sand I'm finding up there right so I've walked up the creek a bit and then I started digging into this this um, blonde sand this is just all light sand but in amongst it you can see all that dark colour That's the black sand in there. There's just a layer, just a thin layer of it. But I'll, I'll dig that out and pan it, and then I'll dig down a bit further and uh, see if I can get some black sand in down a bit further. Okay, I'll be back, guys. Okay, what I've been doing, I've been just digging around, taking samples, and there's a big lump of bedrock just here. So what I did, I dug in behind it where... Um, all the heavies, when they come, when the water come racing down through all, all, with all the material, the water's dropped out here. It's slowed down, so everything's dropped in here. There's a lot of, still a lot of sand there, but I'm digging into gravels now, and um, so I'm digging, been digging a couple of handfuls out of there so far. I'll just set this up here, and I'll just show you what I've been doing. I'm just um, sitting out there the larger rocks just sieving them out and then I've got all the finer material in the pan and I'm just panning this out and when I get down to the heavy material in the bottom I'm just chucking it in a bucket and I'll take this home and um, I'll probably put it through a finer screen again and then I'll run it across the miller, miller table and if there's any fine gold in this stuff, it'll the mill table should catch it. That's the plan anyway. So I'm just panning it down. There's, there's still going to be a, still going to be some um, some light material in it, but I'll be catching all the the heavier stuff on the bottom, the black sand, and all the gold if there's any. I'll just chuck it in the bucket. And that's what I've got so far. I've got that material so far. So I'll do a bit more panning and I'll get a bit more material. And um, yeah, then I'll just take it home. Okay, I'll catch this in a bit. Right guys, I'm back at home now and I've set up the miller table and I'm just starting to run it, run a bit of this material that I brought back. There's a lot of um, a lot of blonde sand in it as you can see but uh, there is a bit of black sand in there. So I've, I've seen a few little little uh, microscopic specks you can just see with the sunlight on you can see them sparkle but I don't know if it's gold or not. I won't know until I get a decent, if I get a decent piece that I can see um, with the naked eye then we'll know but at the moment they're just really fine specks, I can see one there another one over here but uh, 
I might have just doing this just to see if there is anything in that in that creek. And if not, if I don't do any good with this, well, I won't be going back there. This gives me something to do anyway. I've got to get into some of these creeks um, and find more black sand. Because uh, I've got more chance of picking up a bit of gold if I can get onto the black sand. I've got to, I've got to find some um, patches of black sand. Nothing's showing up at the moment. Like I said, just a couple of little microscopic specks I can see with the sun shining on them. Anyway, I'll run a bit more and I'll get back. Okay. This is all the shiny pieces that I spent that was sticking up in the on the miller's table so we'll just see what we got there's no there's no big pieces all I saw was just little tiny specks so alright we'll see heaps of little tiny specks but I don't even know if it's gold. It looks like gold, but I got I got caught out before with that bloody copper. Does that copper look a goldy colour? It looks like gold. It's staying up the back of the pan like gold. some specks of gold in the glasses on but I'll, I'll just try and show you if I can I can't really get in close enough but there's a couple of specks just up up in the back here along there they're really small really tiny I don't know if you'll be able to see them I'll take a close-up picture, then I'll um, I'll take a picture under my microscope, and you'll be able to see them then. Okay, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.